Okay. You know what? Let's take this one slow and steady. We've got plenty of men here to use. Come on, you sack. Ooh. He has one of those sentinel beams, which is really bad news. He's also got a carbine, I think. Ooh, and his shields. We don't like it when they have shields. Get out of here, sir. Oof, almost cut down my own grunt. Almost. All right, careful, guys. Careful with those nades. Almost lost my head. Almost. Well done. We haven't won yet. Oof. And now we have no shield. Which is very bad. Luckily, I guess these guys... I think these guys do look a little bit more distinctive. With the remastered graphics. And they are using the corpses of the Sentinels as weapons. Which is funny. Just in case you really needed to nail that heretic vibe. Alright, we're out of ammo. Um, let's... You know what? Yeah, sure. Let's go for some dual-wielding action. Heretics! There you are. This is not great. Make sure both weapons are charged. It kind of feels like needlers are uh, the... Whoa. <laughs> He's jumping and bouncing all over the place. Uh, essentially, there's the terminal. Um, a stand-in for the human SMGs. Uh, now, how would one get up here? Aha! We can have a bit of a history lesson. Whilst I drink some more of my uh, drink. Glorious day. The prophets will be pleased that we have rescued an oracle from the humans' violation of the Holy Temple. Why do you keep calling it a temple? My installation was a weapon, and one which we needed very, very badly. But Oracle, I do not understand. We were told the rings are salvation, a gateway to paradise. Told? By whom? Anyone who told you that is a fool, or quite, quite mad. That installation was a beautiful tool, designed to destroy everything the Flood might feed on. Everything? Oh, quite everything. And if even one flood spore survived the destruction of my ring... Communications. Shut down all lines to the fleet. We will not notify the prophets of our discovery until I hear everything this oracle has to say. I will gladly share what I am permitted, but we have little time. What has been unleashed here could destroy everything you have ever known. On that, oracle, we are in agreement. So, looks like uh, our friend 343 managed to get to this mining station. And it uh, looks like he converted these guys into heretics. How curious. 
Alright, well, no time to sit here and worry about such things. We've got murderizing to do. Lots of murderizing. Good lord. <laughs> I love the way the <laughs> I love the way the elites laugh to themselves. <laughs> it will never not be entertaining to me. Especially when they start maniac their little maniac laugh and then die. Oh, it pleases me. Okay. No way! Alright, I'll be first in, last out, as always. Evening, me laddos. Ooh, that was a little bit too much pink death. Yeah, the weapons in Halo 2 are... Oh dear, oh dear, this is going badly. Yep. The weapons in Halo uh, 2 are way more varied and way more fun. Than they were in the original game. I mean, they were in the original, like, they were fine. But they were quite limited. Alright, how's it looking? I think we're good. I have discovered a new drink. I don't know whether it's new. But I am finding myself quite addicted to it. It is uh, Levi Root's new energy drink. Uh, and he does, in two flavours, watermelon with a hint of chilli. So it's an a energy drink that is infused with chilli. And, my God, <laughs> it works. I mean, I'm a sucker for spice anyway, but... I didn't realise it had chilli in it when I first bought it. But I, it's, it's very subtle. It's like in the back of your throat. I was like, there's something weird. Am I allergic to this drink? Is there something weird going on? Now I read the ingredients and I'm like, oh. Oh, you sly little pepper, you. I see what you're, see what you're up to. And I'm a fan. Whoa. Uh, and he also does another one, which is a pineapple kind of like fruit crush flavor with a hint of uh, ginger, which is incredibly nice as well. So that is what I'm us ooh, usually slurping on, if it's not coffee anyway. Uh, this guy has died in a very unfortunate <laughs> position. It's fine. All right, come on, man. Ooh. This is bad. Probably. Whoa! I literally just turn around and I'm like looking straight at a grenade. Not really the most optimal thing to be staring at. Not gonna lie. Let's kill those guys. If we can. Ooh, shields. Shields have failed. Yeah, I'm going to stay and fight. Don't worry. I'll be back. Don't panic. Gutless? How dare you? Uh-oh. That's bad. Alright, this is fine. Let's lean on our men a little bit here. Alright. Looks like we've cleared the area. Yeah, so these sentinels are kind of a problem, to be honest. Yep. There's no way we're going to stand up to that many needle rounds. This is fine. Oh, okay. We've already got the checkpoint. Cool. Yeah, I think by the time you've been stuck with about seven... I think it's seven needles. Yeah. See, we were stuck with so many needles there. Uh, even going invisible, like, didn't save us because we already had so many needles stuck in our ass. Right, you're done. Can we... Damn it. There we go. Whew. Really do need to lean on that. Um... Ability as much as we possibly can. Like I say, it's not great for actually sneaking around because it doesn't last long enough. But for getting you out of trouble, it certainly works. 
Come on, you little grunty bastards. There we go. Plenty, plenty of needles for all of you. Oh, hello. Have an elite. Now, unfortunately, dual wielding does mean we can't use grenades. Which, uh, you know, is a slight issue. But it makes sense, considering the like overwhelming firepower that we do get in return. Alright, careful now. Careful. Careful. Oof. Alright, let's go. Let's go hide. Luckily, these weapons are fully charged. What are you doing there? I don't know why our friendly elite was just standing there. Ooh. He threw an aid. Pretty sure. Didn't see where that nade went. He, well, he either threw a nade or he's pointing at us. Looks like he's pointing at us. Insolent grunt indeed. Looks like all of our grunts are dead. That's unfortunate. All right. Well. Deal with him, my brothers. I will defend the oracle. Uh -huh. It's truth is not going to be silenced. Surely. Uh, there goes my friend. That's somewhat problematic. Uh, I'm sure it's fine. Yeah, one needle practically collapses our shields. Right, okay. Oh, hello. Mr. Elite Friend. It's completely dissolved his face into a pulp. Alright. Let's try and get you down before you kill me. Uh, that's not good. Alright, that'll work. Whew. Uh-oh. Rather not deal with oracles. Or sentinels, as the human calls them. These things really do sting. They sting hard. Are we good? I think so. Hey! Friendly Phantom in route. <laughs> He's dusted. Alright, bit of air air combat. Oh, they made it so much more visceral. Now, you can do tricks and things in Banshees this time around. But I don't know how I do it on the PC. So, you know. Also, our Banshee does appear to be getting a little bit beaten up. Which is less than ideal. All right, we're good. At least. All right, we can do that. Let's keep progressing. Uh, kind of tempted to go back for another Banshee, but we'll make do with what we have for now. Now, I don't believe... You know what? We're almost back there. Let's go grab another one. Uh, I don't believe our friend can actually get destroyed here. Which is nice. Yeah, this thing is toast, man. Unfortunately, we do drop our second dual-wielded weapon. Ah, there we go. That's how we use our boosters. Very nice. Unfortunately, if you boost, you can't fire. Uh, you can also boost in the ghost as well. <laughs> Smooth moves, Xlax. Okay, this looks really questionable up here. Not sure how much of this I want. There's a lot of fuel rod cannons going off. Let's get a strafing run going. Ooh, almost. Alright, that's fine. Let us 
Well, it doesn't look that clear to me. His banshee is still holding on by a thread. Whoa, look at this guy. This guy's a badass. There he was. Luckily, they do prioritize attacking the uh, phantom. Which actually helps us quite a lot. Whoa. Okay, he's gone. I don't know how we use our fuel rod cannon. Which is upsetting. Let's get rid of those turrets. Alright, we're good, we're good, we're good. All good? Alright, let's keep searching. Let's go get a fresh banshee. That one's a little bit worse for wear. Luckily, these things are everywhere. The heretics had quite a decent force, it would seem. Yeah, I don't know how we do the aerial maneuvers on uh, keyboard and mouse. It's probably not that difficult, but I don't want to push the wrong button and then uh, exit my ship and fall to my demise. My sky. Mine. There we go. Alright, looks like we've got some heavy, heavy fuel rod fire coming. I like the way with the new Banshee designs as well. Uh, you can see our feet hanging out. It's much less of a completely enclosed cockpit than the original design. Kind of really illustrates the fact that the Banshee is nothing more than a fancy glider. Really. Cheap disposable craft. Alright, let's keep going. Must have killed them all. At least most of them by now. This is certainly going to be coming problematic. Landing zone? Where'd be the landing zone? Aha! Wow. That storm's not looking great. Still, no time to worry about that. Oof. Certainly don't want hot bolts of plasma impacting us. Yeah, that hurts. That really hurts. Let's get out of it. This is fine. Is that a piece of my ship? Oh, I don't know what happened there. <laughs> it looks like there's a grunt there as well. It's a dead grunt. That's cool. Dead grunts are the best grunts. Alright. Evening! Okay, this is... Wait, am I killing everybody, including my friends? Not entirely sure. Whoa! Okay, that was the heretic leader. He's in space now. Fuel rod cannon. <laughs> that was chaotic. What I'm going to do, uh, I'm actually going to end this video here. Just because everyone's about to come home now. What is it? That stench. I've smelled it before. Uh oh. That's not good. And indeed, that is not good. Juggernaut. Well, what could that possibly be alluding to? Unfortunately, we're going to have to discover that in the next episode. So thank you very much for watching, guys. And as always, until next time.